Hello everybody, it's Mel from Mel's Coin Corner. Uh, just wanted to give a big thank you to Shibby Rob. Uh, if you don't know who Shibby Rob is, go check him out. He does coin art hunts, he does auctions. Very knowledgeable about foreign silver and grading coins and everything else. He usually gets good deals on his auction. Always gives out a lot on his coin roll hunts. In fact, this here was all... Sorry about that. All from a $25 donation. So first off, you get that. You get the choice of a 90%er. Um, he sent me a 42S. I think that's an S. Yeah. He usually has S mints and stuff like that. Um, then on, on my roll, he has every roll marked. So on one of the rows, I got this 1857 Flying Eagle. It was a special row with a happy face on it. Look at that. My first eagle. I've been collecting for 40 years and finally got an eagle for my collection. That will stay in my collection. And then on the other row was a quarter mystery box pool. He pulls the V-nickel out. It's full of different things. Well, first, he pulled this out, the Cumberland Gap die chip on the hat. Which he didn't think that was fair enough, so he drawed again and got me the V-nickel. And then he gave me, this was my quarter, a 42S. Then he didn't find any silver on my rolls, so he sent me a rosy dime for the skunk rolls. So I think that was a pretty decent $25 donation right there. So next, uh, he had two auctions. I bought participated in two auctions. Can't remember what all I bought on each one, but... $2 bill in pretty decent shape, especially for 28. Love these things as if anybody watches my channel does know. Picked up the proof 2012 ASC. Beautiful box, COA, everything's in there. And I picked up the bicentennial set since I was giving one of my other ones away. Thought I'd go ahead and bid on this and end up getting it. So Ended up picking that up. Pretty good deal. Picked up a large cent. 43. No, 45. It's got a few little dings here and there, but it's still very nice shape. Picked up four walk, or Barbers. 05S. 060. 13D and a 14S. So it's pretty cool. And I basically picked these up kind of to put in deals and resell. I um, probably won't have auctions. I don't know. For a little bit, I'm debating whether I want to have an auction or not because a silver price, I don't want people to think my prices are too high, but. So I also picked up this shield nickel. I have one in my collection, but couldn't see the date. But now I got one with the date. So I thought that was pretty cool. 1868. And then I always just pick these up if the price is right. So I got a graded silver quarter, which I probably I'll probably end up selling that eventually. So that's what I got in the pack in the mail today in one package. Thought that was pretty good. So I thought I'd share it. Thank you guys very much. God bless. I'll catch you on the next one.